Hello and welcome to Blissmos Academy. Today we will learn on how to download and install PyCharm. Before we begin with the download process, let's look into what is PyCharm. PyCharm is an IDE used in computer programming, specifically for Python language. Why do we need PyCharm? PyCharm is more productive. It provides coding assistance and analysis. It highlights syntax and coding errors. It also boosts code quality. What are the prerequisites to download PyCharm? You need Oracle Virtual Machine. You need Ubuntu. You can also download and use in Windows as well. You need Python and PySpark. If you're looking for more details on PyCharm, please visit www.jetbrains.com slash PyCharm. Let's begin with the process of PyCharm download and installation. So please note, I'm trying to download the PyCharm in Ubuntu. You can also download and work in Windows as well or Mac as well. So go to your terminal. Uh, you need to give the command as sudo snap install pycharm community classic i'm trying to download the community version here you you can also get uh, the professional version which is a paid version so community version is always free so just hit enter it will ask for the password you need to give the password the download has started please note that there is other way to download uh, the pycharm as well you can go to the website jetbrains website and you can download the file from there and then import the file to your ubuntu uh, via terminal but this is the easiest way to do you can just download the whole pycharm in one hence we are trying to explore the power of terminal command as well the download and installation both are done now to check whether the pycharm has been installed or not you can click here and you can check as pycharm here it is this is the icon of pycharm click on the same you need to agree with the terms and conditions of uh, jet brains uh, click on continue don't send so we are done with the download and installation of PyCharm. This is how PyCharm looks like. Before we begin with the PyCharm, there is one more installation that needs to be done as part of the Python package. Let's do it, do it first. Go, go back to your terminal and type as sudo apt get install python three this tutorials d i s t u t i l s enter once the installation is done go back to your pycharm click on new project so here is the new project name if you want you can change this project name but i would like to leave it as it is and click on create as part of this download and installation, I would also like to show you the linking between PySpark and PyCharm so that you can create the PySpark projects in PyCharm. Okay, so tip of the day, you can just close this. This is the project which we created. Now, click select the project name which you have created and go to file settings we are trying to create the link between PySpark and pycharm so that you can create the PySpark projects here go to the project python project 
select on python interpreter here it is default it is selected as python 3.8 if not you will have to add it here go to settings add system interpreter and here you need to select and add it in case if it is not selected in your system it is also showing i need to install the packaging tools so please click on the same so these are the python packaging tools you need to provide your password this installation may take some time okay so, so once this installation is done click on the plus icon here plus and you need to type on the search bar as PySpark. So click on install package here this will import all the PySpark package into PyCharm again you need to provide your password here you can see the installation is running package PySpark installed successfully so we are done with the installation of PySpark you can close this and please don't forget to click on apply and okay we are done with the PyCharm download in and installation linking of PySpark in PyCharm as well thank you for watching the video for more videos and big data related courses, please visit www.blissmosacademy.com. Thank you.